Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday. God knows I love a Saturday. So, I got up like at 6. Stayed in bed till 7. Kind of came out, checked out the weather, um, went to the bathroom, and then lay back in bed again. Played on my phone till I heard AJ. And then he came and got in bed with me. And we hung out for probably another 30 minutes. I think it's like 10 something in the morning right now. We've already done breakfast. That was done in the 8 o'clock hour, I guess. And AJ came out just of the bedroom a few minutes ago and he was so like grumpy and demanding lunch. I don't think he ate a lot of dinner last night. And, um, I don't think the Cheerios was enough. So, he had an early lunch. But that's okay. Beautiful day. Brought the birds out. Um, I never really leave them out here all night. I suspect they would probably be fine. But, I don't do that to them. But they do stay out a lot during, um, the weekends. As long as weather is permitted. Permitting. So here's the problem that I had last week. I folded laundry. I even still have some more towels in the dryer. And I didn't put it up. So I've been living off this dryer all week. Right now, I decided to put my kitchen rugs in. I'm going to put it on a speed wash. And then I'm going to stick them outside to dry. Hey everybody, so here I am. I am still looking like a crazy mess. The house is okay. I've got laundry going over here and been working on the computer over there. AJ and I picked up the groceries that I'm going to talk to you about. Well, but let me, let's go find the meals because I had to write them down. Because. Okay, so I found them. Thank goodness. So. These are mainly crock pot meals because this was given to me by, or bought in. Okay, so I have them. There's our fish. It's so beautiful. Um, I have the vacuum out. The house this is kind of what it is right now. But the meals. So all these are intended, or most of them, for this beautiful Black & Decker new crock pot. That was a gift from a subscriber. It was so kind. And see how you can write on it? I love that. So, let's go through some of these meals. So, honey garlic chicken, French dip sandwiches, chili mac and cheese, a breakfast casserole, spinach salad. Now, listen, I didn't put these into Notion. I just wrote them down on a piece of paper at work. I might be forgetting some meals. I'm not sure. But I did the best I could. And after the food haul last week where I bought a lot of stuff, I clearly don't need to do that another week in a row. So I got a couple bigger items. So in case the older kids are here tonight, tomorrow, or usually middle of the week, I have affordable meals to feed them. Um, because they eat more, you know. So for the French dip subs... Or French dip sandwiches, basically. I have um, this big London broil roast. And it's perfect. It is absolutely perfect. It's a cheaper cut of meat. You can see how much I paid for it. It's actually on sale, I think. Whatever. But it was not expensive. I think it was like $12. And this will go right into the crock pot. For the honey... What was it? The honey garlic chicken... I'm going to put that in the crock pot as well. And I got this jasmine rice to go with it. So, um, that's going to work out really, really well. I also have a breakfast casserole that I plan on making for dinner. Because my family loves breakfast casseroles. This is um, bacon for that. And it does take sausage as well. And it takes shredded hash browns. So all that's for that. One of these bacons is for a warm spinach salad. Which I love. And AJ definitely won't eat that for dinner. Um, but I thought about having it for dinner. And maybe for lunch. Whatever. 
And then, AJ, I have pizza or something different. Speaking of AJ, Lunchables were on sale today. I normally would have only gotten a couple. He likes these on the weekend sometimes. So, we got this big one with the drink. We got these two pizza ones and a chicken nugget. I like the chicken nugget one. The ketchup in these things is amazing. I just don't get it. I don't even know if it's ketchup. I don't know what it is, but it's so good. For the breakfast casserole, I do have some cheese in the refrigerator, some of this exact cheese, but I wanted to make sure I had enough. And also for the um, sandwiches I'm making out of this, I have a whole package of provolone cheese that I haven't even opened yet. I love you. I do. Uh, AJ just wanted a cookie. cookie. So um, I got him one of them. But. I also got eggs. This is not like the kind I usually get, but the kind I usually get was like delivery only, which is such bullshit. They know I like it, and so they'll keep it at a low price until you actually just want to do an in-store pickup. It's crazy how that works. I got two things of cinnamon rolls. These are a staple in our home. Brittany and AJ tend to eat those a lot. AJ absolutely loves Oreos. It's his favorite cookie. He does have Oreos from last week, but he picked out these and that was fine with me. I got some beef broth for the um, French dip sandwiches and that's the sandwiches that I have the provolone for as well. And then one night I'm going to make a chili mac and cheese in the crock pot. So I've got a couple things I'll need for that, which is the tomato paste, some Rotel. It just makes it so much easier. And then one can of chili beans. I know we're not really in the weather for chili, but it's such a hearty meal. Again, if Brittany and Jackson show up and it's me and AJ and Ryan starts crying and wants a plate to take home or whatever, I have plenty of food. I don't like plan on Ryan. I just want you guys to know that. But there's nights that He'll be like, I'm broke, I don't have nothing for dinner, and sometimes I'll send a plate home with him. When he drops up AJ after school, um, or in the evening, I will sometimes give him a plate to take. But, that's not really a consideration for me, but the older kids are. So, Brittany, I don't know if she'll be here for dinner tonight, but she'll be here tonight. She works, like, weekends, all the time, 10 to 10. So, these bigger meals will probably be later in the week. I got some hoagie rolls. Those are for those French dip sandwiches. Some sour cream, which actually goes into the breakfast casserole, I believe. This was the other thing that AJ requested. We make cookies all the time. But he just wanted some like these, and I got them for him. I got a sweet tea and a milk. We tend to go through a gallon a week on the milk. Um, I got him some apples. We have a few left from last week, but not enough. One red onion for that warm spinach salad. Now, I don't eat mushrooms, so my spinach salad is mushroom-free. Um, but I do, and it's kind of odd, I do like tomatoes in mine. And it also come, you know, you put a soft-boiled egg in it, and you got apple cider vinegar, and some bacon grease, and it kind of wilts that spinach down. It's fabulous. So I got some baby spinach for that, the red onion for that. I got scallions for every meal, basically, because I love them, and they're a great addition. And they sometimes give a very drab meal, a little bit of color and taste. Strawberries, bananas. We don't buy a lot of them anymore. Um, I'm pretty much the only one who eats those, I feel like. Um, I needed a couple onions for the meals this week, and then I got this little seedless watermelon, which is the perfect size for AJ and I. I hate getting a big watermelon. So, again, not a whole lot, like, but plenty for us, and, um, I'm happy with this week's meals. I think they'll be good. I'm anxious to use the new crock pot, simply because... It's such a help. Do I think you get like five star meals out of a crock pot? Not usually. There's a lot of dump and go meals. There's ones that obviously you can brown your meats and cook your meats before obviously putting them in, which will give them more flavor. And, and there's lots of different things, but 
it's so nice to come home after a long day at work and know that with just a few steps when you walk in the door, maybe steaming some fresh vegetables or whatever it may be, cutting some fruit up, you have a meal that's already done and ready. And, you know, I work in the kind of place I can come home on lunch if I want to check on it or whatever. So, very grateful for the crock pot. We are definitely putting it to work this week. I'm sorry, there are some really loud kids out right now. But, I came outside just to kind of sketch out my dog that I'm going to paint. Again, you guys, this is nothing that fancy, I promise. It's just something to kind of entertain myself with. And I saw this picture. Let me show it to you. Now, my background isn't quite as light. But you guys can kind of get an idea of what I'm going for. And that's it. So, I'm on my way. Good morning, everybody. It is a beautiful Sunday morning, and I just got out of the shower a few minutes ago, and um, we slept till about, AJ got up about 7.30. I kind of got up around the same time, but didn't get out of the bed till after 8. When he got up, he called his dad, and Ryan came over and took him for donuts. We're still, like, just so on edge really we're just not like matching up but that's okay
because of the whiskers. I did it like three times. I gave it my all. But being that this is textured, the whiskers cannot come over it that easy. And if I put them coming here, they look weird. So this is my dog painting without whiskers. But who cares? This is a home painting. And you know what? I really enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed watching me do it and listening to the music. Definitely feel free to paint it yourself if that's something you're interested in. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to be doing some other painting videos as well. Again, if this is not your cup of tea, definitely skip it. Find another video on my channel. But for me, this is really fun and I enjoyed doing it.